Hey guys, so today I wanted to share my top picks from MAC Cosmetics. <gasps> First thing is the Studio Fix Fluid Foundation. It has an SPF 15 in it. It is a medium coverage, but you can build it up to full coverage, and um, it's very good. It covers up all of your blemishes. If you have a lot of blemishes, you can cover it up with your concealer afterwards. I wear NC25 in winter and NC30 and C35 during summertime. <laughs> Moving on to concealers, the one that I want to highlight today is the Prolong Wear Concealer. I love this concealer. It has a pump that squirts a lot of product out and just a waste of concealer. So yeah, that's the downside of it. But all in all, it has a great coverage. It gives you a great coverage and it conceals all of your redness or if you have um, blemishes, it will cover up all of your blemishes. So it's a really good product. If you want to invest in a good concealer, just get the Prolong Wear Concealer. And as the name states, it's going to last you for a very long time and it's good. It's a good product to mix with your moisturizer before you apply your makeup. It's gonna give you a pretty luminous finish uh, if you don't want to look matte and if you want a little bit of luminosity, apply this before you put your foundation on or your powder. Next thing is Fix Plus. Fix Plus is a universal product. You can apply it before you do your makeup to refresh your skin before applying your makeup. Uh, and you can use it as a finishing mist. This is what I do the most of the time. Uh, I apply it after I do all my makeup, especially after I apply my powder because nobody wants to look cakey. So here's the helper. <laughs> product that I'm going to be using this summer all the time it's going to be Studio Fix MAC so it's this foundation in a powder form on a fuller coverage even after you apply a foundation you can apply this uh, powder foundation and you're going to get um, more coverage if if you want to use it alone if you have an oilier skin if you want to use it in summer especially when it's hot and you don't want your makeup to melt down I use this. After I apply my tinted moisturizer, I apply this powder and it gives me full coverage, so it's, good. it's a good product. I need a setting spray. I would recommend the Mineralize, Mineralize Skin Finish Natural. Uh, I have it in a shade medium plus, but I purchased this in summer and I think I'll be medium in, during winter time. So it's a, it's a good product to set your makeup after you're all done, you just apply this to set and it's gonna, your makeup's gonna last much longer. <laughs> I love MAC brushes, so if you want to invest in a good high quality brushes, I would recommend these two brushes. Um, these are the ones that I have. This is my MAC 168 brush, and all of them have white bristles. This is MAC 217 brush. The reason why I like them is because they're super, super soft and they apply the product very well. MAC 168 brush is an angled contouring blush brush. I use it to apply a blush as well as to contour contour my cheekbones. I use it to apply my eyeshadow as well as to blend it out. So it's a very good brush. I really 
like the lip liner from MAC. It's called Subculture. It's a beautiful nude, um, it's a beautiful nude lip liner. It is similar to your lip shade. Uh, I really do like it. I apply it before I apply my lipstick or sometimes I wear it alone. So it's pretty good for that. <laughs> This is the MAC Sheer Tone Blush in Peaches. I've been using this for two years now, so it'll last you a long time. And I'll apply it. So it's not very pigmented and you can blend it out very easily. So that's why I like it for everyday use. Um, if you're looking for a poorly peachy color, get the peach. <laughs> Last but not least, the lipstick. I love MAC lipsticks. Um, there are lots of uh, sheets that I like, but the ones that I want to highlight is uh, Ruby Woo, um, Cream Cup, Candy Yum Yum, um, what else? And some others as well. So they have good lipsticks, very pigmented. This one is a cream sheen line. So if you're looking for a pinky nude, for every day this one hope you can see it so it's a pretty lipstick for every day um thanks so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video